Top 10 Insane Swing Balls in Cricket History Ever Number 10 in the fourth test of the 2004 Australia Tour of India at Wankhede Stadium in Mumbai, Glenn McGrath bowled a swinging delivery that dismissed Virender Sehwag for eight. The ball pitched on leg stump and swung away late, clipping the off bail to send Sehwag's off stump cartwheeling. It was a reminder of his ability to swing the ball late. Number 9 On the third day of the third test between England and New Zealand in Auckland, English fast bowler Andy Caddick bowled an in-swinging delivery that dismissed Mark Richardson for five. The ball pitched on off stump and swung in sharply. It was a reminder of his ability to swing the ball in sharply. Number 8 Dale Steyn bowled a beautiful out-swing delivery to dismiss Michael Vaughan for 10 in the first test of the 2004 England Tour of South Africa at St. George's Park, Port Elizabeth. The ball pitched outside off stump and swung away late, clipping the off bail to send Vaughan's off stump cartwheeling. Number 7 In the third test of the 1995 New Zealand Tour of India, Chris Cairns bowled an out-swing Yorker to Sachin Tendulkar, which knocked his off stump out of the ground. It was a devastating delivery, and it ended Tendulkar's innings. Cairns bowled the ball from over the wicket, with a Yorker length and a hint of away swing. Tendulkar played at the ball, but he was beaten by the movement. The ball swung away to him and hit the off and middle stump, then off stump knocking it out of the ground. Number 6 in the third test of the 1993 Pakistan Tour of the West Indies, Wakar Yunus bowled an in-swing Yorker to Phil Simmons, which knocked his off stump out of the ground. It was a devastating delivery, Yunus bowled the ball from around the wicket, with a full length and a hint of in-swing. Simmons played at the ball, but he was beaten by the movement. The ball swung into him and hit the off stump. The ball crashed into Phil Simmons' off stump. Shoaib Actor bowled an in-swing delivery that beat Marcus Treskothic's bat and uprooted his off stump. It was a devastating delivery that set the tone for the match. The delivery was a perfect example of Actor's raw pace and power. It swung in sharply from wide of off stump. Treskothic was unable to react in time, and the ball crashed into his stumps. Number 4 in the second innings of the second test match between India and Sri Lanka at Kandy in 2001, Chaminda Voss bowled an in-swing delivery that Shiv Sundar Das left, but the ball hit the top of his off stump and bowled him out, and it swung in sharply from wide of off stump. Das was expecting the ball to swing away, and he left it too late. The ball crashed into his stumps. Unfortunately it was no ball. Number 3 on the second day of the fourth and final test match between India and West Indies in Kingston, Jamaica, on July 1, 2006, Indian fast bowler Shantakumaran Srisant bowled a swinging delivery that uprooted Chris Gale's off stump. Gale was out for a duck. He bowled a short-pitched delivery that swung in sharply to Gale, who was caught off guard and edged the ball onto his stumps. The dismissal was a major blow to West Indies. Number 2 The England tour of New Zealand in 2008 included a second test match held at Wellington. During this match, James Anderson bowled a beautiful outswing delivery to dismiss the New Zealand batsman Matthew Bell. James Anderson, known for his ability to swing the ball both ways, used his skill to produce an outswinger that deceived Matthew Bell and resulted in his dismissal. The delivery was also a sign of things to come for Anderson. Number 1 O'Connor bowled a brilliant in-swing Yorker to Steve Waugh on the third day of the second test between New Zealand and Australia at the Waka ground in Perth in 1997. The ball swung in late and crashed into Waugh's stumps, leaving him out for 96. O'Connor's Yorker to Waugh is considered one of the best deliveries ever bowled in test cricket. It was a perfect example of skill, timing, and precision. 
O'Connor had to bowl a perfect line in length to get the ball to swing in late and hit the stumps.